got me nowhere. There's a switch back here. Aha! Uh -huh. yes. Okay. Looks. Yep. Oh my goodness. Two hit points at the moment. Uh, yes, I know. Okay. Doesn't tell you the color. Well, I guess that was a green one. Thank goodness. See if that frog has something to say. Ribbit, ribbit, just between you and me. I saw Doriel come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her. Ribbit. Hmm, intimidated. Doriel? She gives them nasty looks, remember? Oh, that's right. Hello. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? Who <laughs> did this to you? You will get an apology. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Er. Well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Seeing such a cute, tiny house in the ruins gives you determination. Do you smell that? Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie! <laughs> I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. 
so I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. This is it! A room of your own? I hope you like it! Is something burning? Um, make yourself at home! An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. A box of kids shoes in a disparity of sizes. Look at those cool toys! They don't interest you at all. Scotch cinnamon pie. You have seen this type of plant before, but do not know its name. This plant, however, you have no idea what it is. Toriel small chair. Its name, name is, is Cherry. <laughs> Aw, she names her chairs. Yes, definitely. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling lonely. The rest of the page is filled with jokes of a similar caliber. Just a regular old bucket, you know, of snails. Ah, the cactus. Truly the most sandra of plants. I do not know what that word is. It might not be a real old. Ooh, you peek inside. <gasps> it's Toriel's sock drawer! You can it's turn on the light. It's a of subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Typha, a group of wetland flowering plants with brown oblong seed pods, more commonly known as water sausages. Definitely bigger than a twin size bed. You just can't stop looking at the socks. I guess I cannot. The flower up there is bright yellow, though. Mm -hmm. Yes, 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 yes. I know. It's a water sausage. Got it, got it, got it. Can't get to the lamp. Inside the drawer are flower seeds and some broken crayons. Room under renovations. Hmm. Oh! This is, it is a water sausage! <laughs> it's you! So, if you figured out what to read the sign would be, then you can go back out and read it. These books are worn. They must have been read many times. The so tutorial is literate. That's nice, I guess. Inside is an old calendar from the beginning of 21X. Hello. Hmm. Books, eh? It's a history book. Here's a random page. Trapped Tra behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Far, far into the earth we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, which we named Home. As great as our king is, he is pretty lousy at names. The ends of the tools have been filed down to make them safer. The fire isn't burning hot. Just pleasantly warm. You could put your hand inside. Hello. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. 
I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? What? This, uh, this, this is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book that I'm reading? Really? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. Oh, God, what was the 72nd use? How about it? Now, how do I get out of here? Um, how about an exciting snail fact? There are no exciting snail facts. Did you know that snails make terrible shoelaces? <laughs> <laughs> I did, actually. I did know that, tails, that snails made terrible shoelaces. Interesting. Uh, I have yeah. to do something. Stay here. Okay. Bye. Seems like the right size for Toriel. Hmm. Hmm. Kitchen. For some reason, there's a brand new, brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. White fur stuck in the drain. Aw, gingerbread monsters! Aw. Huh, it's too, too too high to read, huh? Yeah. Well, I don't know where she went. La la la, go this way. She's still not here. I want to go back this way. And clearly, there's nothing for me to do except go down these stairs into the basement. Hi. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Yes. Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. Ooh, exciting. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. Okay, then. I am going to destroy it. Wait, what? No one will ever be able to leave again. Uh, that sounds terrible. Now be a good child and go upstairs. Toriel? Toriel, where are you going? Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. Oh, jeez. So if I sit down here, I never die? You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. Who the fuck is Asgore? I am only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Um, no. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. You want to leave so badly? <laughs> you are just like the others. Oh, I'm sorry, Toriel. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Victorial. You have many choices.
knows best for you. <laughs> Aww. That is right. Go upstairs. I'm almost dead, though. Do you have any items that will heal you? Do I have any? I don't even know if I look at my items. Um, was C for menu, I think it was? That's weird. Um, it shouldn't go away like that. Uh, maybe it's because you're in a room with the monster. You could also search to see if there are places you can find uh, um, healing items. There was a door you didn't go in way back at the beginning, I think. And you might be able to buy another spider donut. And also, I think saving heals your HP, maybe? Yeah. I'm not sure. I know this is incredibly boring, but... Say hello about yourself. Call her mom! Oh boy. Nobody picked up. There's a door way back where I didn't go through? Uh, way back at the beginning of the game. Oh, God. Seeing such a cute tiny house in the middle of the ruins fills you with determination. I guess you're back up to full. So I suppose you could just go, you know, practice some more mm -hmm. against her until you can figure it out. I think you might do better, like, trying to stay in the center and moving up and down. Maybe. At least when she does the, 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 the swirly thing attack. I don't know what else to call it. Already? What will it take for you to learn your lesson? through you. Oh dear. Um. So. Oh, the butterscotch power to give me HP. Yep. Oh, no. I guess I, I did lose some. I don't know. I've not seen anyone try just talking. Mm. 
That is right. Go upstairs. I mean, apparently I have to just spare her repeatedly and not die. And if, yep. I, and if I spare her enough time, she gets bored. Yep. Or you have to fight her repeatedly and not die. If you fight her enough, she... Turn around and save. It returns to where you were for. It's just not that different. I suppose you could have got your butterscotch pie back that way. Mm. But not anymore. But like I said, there may be some other uh, items that you can use to heal. And if you have them with you, you can survive a longer encounter. And we're really disinclined to go all the way back to the very beginning of the game. Well, mm. You also, it would also serve you well to get really good at dodging stuff, because there's going to be a lot of that in the game, too. So. Run away! What are you proving this way? Fight me or leave! easy to dodge. That's all she does from now on. You're good. And she just had to get through the first hard one. Stop looking at me that way! Uh-oh. This may be one of the old ones. Go away! Oh, there's still that one. 
Okay, cool. I don't recall how many times you have to do what, but... I know you want to go home, but... But please, go upstairs now! I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we do not have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please, go upstairs. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. No, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However... When you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Aww. Goodbye, my child. Warning, warning, this video is almost over. Warning, warning, it's time to choose another one. This has gone on far too long, time to wake up and sing along. Warning, warning, this video is over now.